<laughs> uh, okay, back to the show. <laughs> hey, guys, this is where we talk about everything because everybody's here, <laughs> with the exception of those who didn't come off the bench for everything. I know we've already posted stories for each other. So, Jonathan, you were first at that. You want to take yours? Sure. So let's let's jump into it. Um, I, I imagine that Aaron is familiar with this one. I don't know if Doc has seen it yet. Uh, Linus Sebastian from Linus Tech Tips started a challenge uh, running Linux on their home machines. Uh, Aaron, have you have you been watching this? No, I have not seen this, actually. I do follow. Uh, I watch the, the channel, obviously, uh, quite faithfully, but I haven't seen this one. What's it about? All right. So uh, Linus and oh, what's his? Uh, it's the co-host on the WAN show, and I, Luke, I believe, is his name. They they both took this challenge for like a month. They are going to install Linux on their home desktops, and they've got like a series of challenges that they're going to go through. And they are dedicated to trying to figure out, is Linux actually a good choice for, for typical gamers is their thing? And uh, uh. some hilarity ensues. Um, so the, the, the thing that happened pretty much right off the bat that I think we can chat about some. Uh, Linus started with System76, uh, uh, with Pop! OS from System76, and went to install Steam, and, you know, he goes through their nice graphical manager and tries to install Steam, and the install fails. And so, you know, a little bit of Googling, and he comes up with this command line uh, command to use apt to install it. And he runs the commands to install it, and it tells him at the bottom, you are about to install, uninstall very important packages. To, to continue, please type in, uh, yes, I'm sure, do it, or something like that. And he types it in and hits enter, and his desktop goes away, and his computer reboots to a command line, and that's it. Because there was, <laughs> there was an, a, a, a dependency problem with the Steam package and the Pop! OS uh, packages, and he ended up uninstalling everything from pop os which means he uninstalled his desktop environment <laughs> oh, <laughs> which is Lord. hilarious um but the, the whole the whole thing is really interesting though because it's these guys that are not linux fanboys looking at it kind of with fresh eyes going all right guys this is broken and if you want more people to use linux you really need to fix this and this is a terrible experience and if you want more people to linux you need to fix this and it's it's, a, it's been a really fascinating series so far and we're only on episode one of it and there's more to come yeah i'm gonna have to go i'm gonna have to go check that out because i mean this is the this was definitely a problem you know 10 years ago or so for me you know that this stuff would happen luckily i could fix it because i know <laughs> linux and i know how to use it but this was a problem for uh, people that were new to Linux, they would come on board, they would they try to install stuff the way that they were typically used to installing it, it wouldn't work. 